What's up YouTube, it's Vinny77 here and today I've got my Lost Origin booster box opening. Sorry it's a bit late, uh, post issues basically is the only uh, reason for that. So let's get into this and I hope you enjoy. Okay, right, before we get into today's opening, I have already opened one Lost Origin box off camera with my girlfriend and here are our pulls. Got Radiant Steelix, Radiant Gardevoir, Spiritomb, Chandelure, the Charizard character card, which I plan on getting graded with Ace, getting graded with Ace rather, uh, Drapion, Berserker, Zoroark, Delphox, Gudra V-Star, Full Art Electrode V, Delayed V, which I really like actually, it looks really cool, except for the fact it's really off center, and the Aerodactyl V Altar, which is incredible. Again, off center. <laughs> Let's get into the main box. Okay, so this is the first time I'm opening a booster box on this channel, so it's going to be a little bit awkward, I think. You probably guessed I already made an incision in the plastic to make this a bit easier. This would be really good to have a front camera. Let me just grab my, my rubbish bag for all my packs. And here we go. So pull-wise, including hollows from the last box, we had 21 pulls if you include hollows from that. So, right, tell you what, if I get one side of the packs out, that might be easier. So we'll go this way. Right, so what I'm going to do for the first half of the box, I'll do the pack trick, I'll do all that kind of thing, and then for the second half of the box, I will just go through it a bit quicker. Right, so we'll start off with the Giratina pack up. One thing we noticed actually with our first box is that the pack arts seem to mirror each other. So the front pack art for this side was a Giratina. The front pack art for the other side is also a Giratina. And then it's actually an Anamorous on both sides then as well. Oops, got the code card. That's for you guys. Right, four, give him a tap. And Darkness Energy, Cedra, Riley. I wish there was a full art of him, he's really cool. Gloom, Parigon, Inkay, Blitbug, Finion, Spinarak, and Trevenant, and then Magiana. Gonna have to figure out how best to place these cards now because I'm gonna run out of room very quickly. Try and keep my camera as well, that would be good. Right. There is the code card. I'm still hoping for all of the Pikachus from the character um, trainer gallery, rather. Swanner, Gloom, Luminion, Wimple, Rhyhorn, Murkrow, Horsey, Marwile, Reverse Luminion, and Dugong. So nothing so far out of two packs. It's uh, Harsh. We found the pull rates a little bit harsh in the first box, but when there was a pull, it was good. So, these packs are tough. Yeah, I like how I got my rubbish bag for all the packs, and then I'm just chucking the packs on the side. It's, uh, makes perfect sense. Right. Lightning energy, energy rather, if I can talk. Ride on, Roserade, Box of Disaster. I'm hoping this isn't a Box of Disaster. Gumi, Marwile, Slegma, Clefairy, Roselia. Oh, another character rare Charizard. I swear, if I have two of this exactly the same box, it will be good, but it'll still be like, why? And then we've got, ooh, Hisuian Zoroark V-Star. So a double whammer. Or a, we got two good cards in a pack, okay? <laughs> I forgot my cases. Hang on a sec. This is what I get for opening cards on the sofa and then transitioning over to the desk to film. I forget everything. Is that off centre? Yep. And it's in exactly the same way as the Aerodactyl. It's really strange. So, two pulls so far from three packs. Like, I'm not gonna be against that at all. I just can't believe I pulled two of the Charizard. Like, I struggled to pull. Charizards from Brilliant Stars. I ended up getting three out of five, just missing the full art and the 
all that, but they were few and far between. Right, so energy is fighting. Lady, Sligu, Electric, Phantom, Sudowoodoo, Electric, Love Disc, Gliga, Sudowoodoo again, and ooh, Iridactyl V. Nice. So doing well on the polls so far. Like, I do like the fact this actually has a background in it too of the volcano and stuff. It looks really cool. So yes, I'm using the uh, Arceus cases today because I've got these left over from the UTB video from a couple of weeks ago. In fact, I have many cases left over from the UTB video a couple of weeks ago. I just haven't opened much since then, but happily I have plenty coming in the next couple of months to open. Now, I will make this announcement now, despite my better judgement, but I have put in a pre-order for the Ultra Premium Collection. I'm not 100% whether or not like it'll show up at the minute, just because it was an early pre-order, but I am very hopeful. So if I do get one, and if it does arrive successfully, there will definitely be a video on that. So Fire Energy, Eastcan, Dotler, Panic Mask, Oddish, Love Disc, Phalanx, or Phalanx, Poliwag, Gligar, Cramorant, and Happy Squirrel. This is basically my equivalent of getting mined. <laughs> I seem to always pull it. Like, I've opened probably less than 20 packs of Fusion Strike, and my two main pulls... Actually, no, that's not true. I have pulled Gengar and Gengar VMAX from it, but my first two pulls from that set, then, were... Uh, Greedent V and Greedent VMAX. Like, if you ever wanted two representatives for a set, they are not it. Psychic, Misfortune Sisters, Porygon, Lake Acuity, Rockruff, Seal, Shuppet, Machop, Pikachu, Reverse Chandelier, and ooh, Kingdra Hollow. Nice. So I will sleeve the hollows just because they are poles, as much as people aren't too fond of them anymore because it's basically the lowest point in a rare set you can get. So, well. so yes, I plan on opening quite a bit of Lost Origin. I may get another booster box, I don't know yet, just because of how many collection boxes I've got coming in the next like month. I think my next opening will be the um, Giratina Pokeball box at the end of September. Give him a tap and metal energy, Silcoon, Lady, Lampant, Snova, Machop, Pikachu, Jinx, Flitwick, Polyrath, and oh, double Polyrath. <laughs> That's typical. So, yeah, I find that the trainer gallery in the first box was difficult. As much as we had the Charizard, obviously, which is a great poll, I think we only had three or four trainer gallery cards in there, and uh, yeah, it, it was tough, I found, so I'm hoping, I think I left the, the code card in the pack, yeah, I did, <laughs> um, so I'm hoping for, I haven't got a trainer gallery in this pack, I know that, because I've just seen the reverse from Bray, uh, hoping for a couple more trainer gallery cards in this, so let's see, Hariyama, Arc Phone, this would have been good as a gold card or a full art as well, I think, Medicham, Clefairy, Apon, Spinarak, Litwick, Roselia, huh, Rockruff, it's quite a good one, and Dustox. So having a bit of a dry streak at the minute, I've just got to stand up straight because I'm leaning over my desk. I'm not sat down for some strange reason, but it, I just find it easier. Apparently not to open packs, so that makes it really difficult. I really hope there's nothing good in this pack now, just purely because I had to butcher it to get it open. There's the code card. Probably better, there's a bit, a bit more light on the end. Give them a tap, and water energy. So, we had quite a funny thing with the last box we did. It seemed whenever we had a water energy, we had a good pull. So I'm hopeful whenever I see a water energy now. Uh, Arazu, Relicanth. Lost Vacuum, can't believe they made a gold card of that. Growlithe, Ducklet, Rockruff, Seal, Zoroa, Obama Snow, and Mimikyu. 
I guess water energy is letting me down with this, so with this prop. So in the comments, could you guys let me know how your pulls have been with this set? So far it might have been good, but I'm hunting the Giratina V altar rather than the Iridactyl, so that was a bit not disappointing, but a bit like, oh, okay. <laughs> so that may have sounded disappointing. I'm not disappointed, I like it. But it was number two on my list. Makahita, Electric, Micro, Cedar, and Cramorant. Yeah, this is a uh, this is tough. So far. As much as this uh, a set with loads of trainer gallery cards and brilliant cards in it. It does seem to have tougher pull rates, I don't know. Like, I'm saying this, and then I've seen like other YouTubers pulling both the Eevee and the Pikachu gold cards, for example, and uh, stuff like that. I'm hoping to pull one of them. I think I'd take the Pikachu over the Mew. Did I say Pikachu and Eevee gold cards? I think I may have. I need more sleep. Right, Metal Energy. <laughs> Misfortune Sisters, Miensho, Lake Acuity, Phalanx, Poliwag, Oddish, Growlithe, Seedot, Oddish again, and Galarian Berserker V. So that's another card I'm doubling up on today. I'm going to have a lot of cards to chuck in the back of my uh, binder for trading, the way this is going. Yeah, I think I think it took me three booster boxes of Brilliant Shards to pull the Charizard V-Star, and then I had the Rainbow Charizard V-Star from just a rat from the Arceus box, and I opened one, <laughs> so it was like crazy luck in that. So I'm hoping that I have some more crazy luck with this box. Water Energy, will we get a pull with this Water Energy? Mian Show, Take Acuity, Nuzleaf, Flipbug, Dinian, Spinarak, Paris, Ink, Honchcrow, and a Vileplume Hollow. Technically a pop. <laughs> See, a trainer gallery's harsh so far. Like, as much as, uh... Yeah, what have we got? Yeah, it's literally just the Charizard so far in the trainer gallery. So, there's got to be another four-ish trainer gallery pulls. I think, out of the boxes I've watched, there's been five trainer gallery pulls in a box, on average. So, there's got to be another four in the box, and we've got another half the box to go. So... Yeah. Right, Darkness Energy. Okay, Gastrodon, Arc Foam, Medicham, Inkay, Basculin, Jinx, Makahita, Bronzo, Stone Journey, and Gliscor. Yeah, fair play. Pulls are harsh. Yeah, watch me pull something ridiculous now and then I'll be like, it's all good again. We will see. We will definitely see. Oh. Yeah, I'm quite tired this weekend. I had an exam last week and it just took it out of me. So, which I passed though, so that was all good. Like, as long as you pass an exam, that makes it worth it. Medicham, Misfortune Sisters, Slugma, Clefairy, Bazelia, Porygon, Pinky, Beautiful, and Clefable Non Hollow. Don't show the code card. I've been going better with that. Yeah, I can show that side of the code card, just not the back of it. Otherwise it spoils it for me and for you. Potentially. Lightning Energy. Sligoo. Electric. Toolbox. Ducklet. Blitbug. Finion. Zoroa. Paris. Parasect. There you go, character card. And Stone Journal. There we go. There is the second character card for this video. At this point in the video, I'm just kind of hoping I'm not rambling too much. Because uh, I seem to just be non-stop talking, but I guess that's kind of the point. You just don't want this in silence. It just makes things awkward. I think I just dropped that pack on the floor. I do like how my phone focuses. It's, uh, it's really good. And if you're wondering what phone it is, it's the Samsung Galaxy Fold 3. And brilliant phone. 100% recommend it if you want something a little bit different. Um, 
yeah, I can't complain about it at all. I think actually saying that, Mr. Mike. My only complaint about it is that the central screen protector is coming off and I can't send the phone off because I need it to work. So it's, uh, it makes it a bit awkward really, because apparently only Samsung can change it slash repair it. So. That pack is really accented, like it's really folded. Anyway, fire energy. The Viper, Stamfisk, Boxer Disaster, Horsey, Marwan, Shellos, Bionicle, Polygon, Polygon again, and ooh, Iridactyl for that. Not bad. This seems to be the Iridactyl couple of boxes that I've been sent, I think. And I was sent, uh, well, I bought these boxes from Total Cards, where I am an affiliate. So there will be a link and a code in, in the description if you decide to buy from them. And uh, you could use both the link and the code, that would be really great, as it will help out my channel no end. There's a code. That's not too bad. We had a good number of pulls actually for the first half of the box. Stumpfisk, Box of Disaster, Sligu, Pikachu, Jinx, Litwick, Oddish, Love Disc, Reverse Mimikyu, and Barbarical Hollow, which I had from the first box. Okay, so maybe just the bags. I've just filled up my first bulk box of like 3,000 cards as well, so that's going to be uh, interesting to send them off at some point. Right, I'm going to go through these packs a little bit quicker now, just because I think I've shown off a lot of the a lot of the cards for the set already. Wimple, Rhyhorn, Nuzleaf. Hunchcrow, and then, and plus we're already 16 minutes into this video, I don't want to keep you all for half an hour, so, yeah, I'll try and speed it up a little bit, I'm very sniffy today, Rockruff, Seals are away, Snowbird, Chop, Litbug, ooh, Giratina V, right, interesting little bit, this is my first ever Giratina card, I've never had or never pulled a Giratina V. I wish it was the old art, but I will stick with this for the time being. Now the rest of that pack, here we go. Right, I think I'm gonna have to start a second pile of cards because I'm running out of room. There we go. This box is already, well this half rather, is starting quite well already. Here's the code. Pikachu, I like that Pikachu. Phantom, so do we do electric, then it. Oh. My Amazon Echo just decided to uh, have a chat, apparently. I'm not entirely sure who with. But anyway. Bit random. I'm interested to see if I can pull the last Radiant card from this box as well, actually. Purely because I uh, managed to get two of them, as you saw earlier from the first spot. That went <laughs> Litwick, Roselia, Rockruff, Seal, Shepherd, Orbital, Hollow. Yeah, I tend to sleeve up pretty much any pull from a box just because. Hollows are technically poles. I know I said that earlier. And there is the code card because I forgot. Because I'm an idiot. And it's a Sunday afternoon. It's a Sunday evening now, I think, in the UK. So, right. Binacle, Mercro, Wimple, Clefairy, Flickertung, Fantina, Minetric. And there's the rest. And I forgot the code card a second time. Because, yeah, I'm, I'm, I am an idiot. Let's just go with that. Yeah, I need to get three, uh, three trainer galleries. I keep calling them character cards. It's the same thing. Three trainer galleries left to continue the rough average of five in a box. Take it down. Oh, Radiant Cardivore again. So that's two Radiant Cardivore. Which, that. I don't know, um, I don't think I'll get it graded, just because 
I don't see the point personally. So I might trade it if uh, uh, if my mate I can do well if my mate wants it now. If not, it can just live in my trade section for a while. Here we go. This is definitely going a bit quicker now. So do we do bronze or electrolyte? Get yeah, asleep, Snova, and Aridos. And there's the rest. So I'm not sure which box has been better so far, pull boys. It's uh Wow, really? It's definitely been tough. I would I would say. But I'm liking Lost Origin as a set. I think it's uh it's good. I'm, I think I'm looking forward more to Silver Tempest now, though. Like, as much as I've been enjoying Lost Origin, the pulls have been good. It's nice actually to get full arts for a change. They, re they really seem to get heavy get full arts, and I've had three today. And they're all different. So, uh, that's been good. But, yeah, Silver Tempest. Oh, God, another Chandelure and another Delphox. Wow, doubling up today. Really doubling up. So, yeah, plenty of... Uh, has to go in my trade section, I think. I think I'll be keeping one of those Charizards, so that can go in my trainer gallery section in my binder, and the other one I will send off for grading. And then there's the rest, and the code card, because I forgot. How many we got? I've got a few. I think we've got about nine left, maybe? Video is getting to about, well, this section of the video is getting to about 20 minutes. So I'll try and speed it up. Gloomy, Bronzo, Snova, Jinx, Inkay, Ambipom, <laughs> Snorlax Hollow. That's a new one. Haven't had that yet. A lot of people quite like the Trainer Gallery card for that. And then there's the rest. And the code card, because I forgot. I'm getting mixed up now. I'm starting to put cards in the code pile and everything. And I'm running out of room for where the packs go. Mianfu, Litwick, Snover, Rhyhorn, Akon, Stunfisk. Ooh, Giratina V-Star. There we go. Pretty good. Off center like nothing. Look at the top of that. Left to right is pretty good though, I think. I can get in the shadow of my thumb off. Yeah, it's pretty good. I think it's just really top heavy. But happy to get that because I am a fan of Origin Form Giratina. I think it's cool. I'm also a fan of giving out code cards at the right time, but apparently that's not going to happen today. So I guess the question is, can we get anything else from this set? I think we'll still do two character, oh god, uh, two trainer gallery cards at this point. This is coming in sideways. That just went sideways. Here's the code card. Yeah, two trainer gallery pulls left, I think. Mama and Dugong. Yeah. So as I said earlier, let me know what pulls you've got from Lost Origin down in the in the comments. Have they been crazy? Like, I, well, I wouldn't call this crazy. I think I think I've got something here actually. I say it, it's not going to be crazy, and I pull something interesting. Growlithe, Sea Dot, Slugma. Ooh, there's something good. I think that's going to be the uh, V Star Marker now, isn't it? Oh wow! No, it isn't. It's the Pikachu V Max Gold Card. Oh wow, that was one of my chase cards, and I am very happy to see it. Cannot tell if the centering is any good, just purely because it's a gold card, so the borders are crazy. But, oh, I'm really happy to have that. And did we get, no, no double pull, but we got the Pikachu VMAX. Really fits in with that gold background in that case. Uh, and then that's what's left. Well, I guess, I guess we can have, um... A poll down in the comments now, which box is better? So you've seen the polls from the first box, the main polls anyway, and you've, seen, you've obviously seen the main polls from the second box since you're here watching. Um, so yeah, let me know which ones you think were better. I know I haven't done the code card yet, but I am just over overly excited because I wasn't sure if I'd get that Pikachu VMAX, so I'm very happy to get that at least. 
and to tick my Giratina box because I don't know how, I must have just been avoiding sets with Giratina in it for the last couple of years, or it just hasn't been printed very much. So, yeah, I don't know. Here we go. Marku Hisa, Bronzor, Phalanx, Polyrag, Oddish, Hariyama, Bayonet, and there's the rest. How many have we got left? I've got two packs left, an Enamorous and Giratina. I'm going to open an Amorous. No, let's leave an Amorous to last because it's the last pack in the actual box as well. So we'll open Giratina and then hopefully we can get some last pack magic with that. I can't believe we've got that Pikachu. I'm really happy with that because I'm going to send that off to Braden, definitely. Because it can be the second Pikachu in my graded collection then. So we've got Electric, Mercro, Shuppet, Wimple, Tynamo, Main, Nectric. Ooh. Pyro Hollow. Not bad. So yes, there we go. And there's the code card. Right, so the question is, I guess, can we get some last pack magic? As much as we had the Pyro Hollow, which means it was a um the colour code card that you want basically. I I forget now. Um can we get something in this last pack? So I am going to slow roll it just because it's the last one. And let's go. So Psychic Energy, Arazu, Porygon 2, Silcoon, Zorua, Paris, Inkay, Jinx, Basculin, Sherpet, <laughs> and Porygon Z. Well, that's just a way to end the box, isn't it? Right, I will just sort these out for the reek. Okay, so this is just a quick recap of the hollows. So we've got Kingdra, Vile Prune, Barbacle, uh, Orbital, and Pyro, as well as Snorlax. Then we managed to get the Radiant Gardevoir. Par then for the Trainer Gallery, gallery rather, if I can speak, we had the Parasect, Chandelier, and the, another Charizard. Then for the Vs, we had Aerodactyl, Berserker, Giratina V, so my first ever Giratina, and Delphox. As well as Aerodactyl V for luck. There. Uh, for the V Stars, we had Hisuian Zoroark V Star, Giratina V Star, and then I left this still last because I would say it's the pull of the box, the Pikachu V Max Gold Card. Now that is a good sum up. So I hope you enjoyed seeing those. Um, I got them from Total Cards, where I am an affiliate, so the link and my code will be down in the, de in the description. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe for more because there definitely will be i think my next opening is going to be the dragonite uh premiable box of pokemon go at the end of september and hopefully hopefully i can get some Yu-Gi-Oh opening soon i'm really looking to but every time i do stuff has either been pushed back or it's out of stock or but i am looking into it so hopefully see you next time and have a good week